Welcome back to Access Carolina. Looking at some events coming up this week, there's a toasty farmer's market and a murder mystery night. And also, time to start enjoying the ice skating scene in downtown with Ice on Main opening. So we've got David Cabron here from Greenville 360. Do you go out there and skate? Are you going to do that? Honestly, I, I have not done that. Yeah. But I think I might have to this year. My son is almost four. He's going to want to do it, so I'm going to be out there probably holding on to him. And because and you'll be using the, the same guide as, as he is to yeah, keep yourself yeah, why steady. Not? You know, we'll both be on it. We'll yeah. we'll do it father son together. So hopefully someone will document that. And that's nice because you can act like you're there to you're teaching him. I would let go of these handles. Yes, but technically I'm teaching myself. But I'm so. teaching my son. That's why I'm holding on. I, he doesn't need to know that. Though. There's always it's such an interesting scene. I mean. Grown-ups who would otherwise be graceful wiping out. You got kids learning new things. It's yes. just a, a beautiful thing. Um, ice on Main opening ceremony yes. this Wednesday. <laughs> it's friendly for all ages, uh -huh. all levels, as you can see. Kids practicing up. Oh, that dad, hopefully he doesn't fall there. <laughs> oh, that kid almost looks like he fell. But uh, they're going to kick off with an opening ceremony this Wednesday at uh, 2 o'clock. They're going to have a local choir, uh, figure skaters doing their thing. And uh, afterwards, at 4 p.m. on Wednesday, you'll be mm -hmm. able to... Um, rent your skates and get out onto the ice. If you dare. It's just uh, it's so many fun events happening there too. It just opens up downtown and that, it's really the sign for people visually. The visually, holiday season it's, is it's, underway. It's here. You're going to have the tree lit up yeah. um, you know, in I think a week and a half from now yep. in downtown Greenville outside uh, the Weston and M. Judson. So uh, it is the season. It is here. If you're ready or not, All right. let's get on and let's <laughs> put on those skates and let's go. And if you're looking for a memorable thing to do on Thursday, yep. you've got uh, People's Tap having a true crime watch party. With the, just watching and relaxing and what? Yeah, so they pick out a, a documentary each week um, and uh, they'll have, you know, you'll get together at 7 p.m. You'll come out to the tap, get a couple local local brews, uh, wine that they have available there. And uh, it will be a true crime documentary watch party. It is for mature audiences, first come, first serve basis when it comes to uh, the table that you grab. Mm -hmm. But uh, after the, the documentary, you'll be able to talk about it and figure out who done it and, uh, you know, just talk about uh, that murder mystery. So just a nice, fun, easy Thursday evening that you can kind of jump out into downtown Greenville and, and check out well, uh, a local spot and, and sip on some drinks. It'll be a great scene, too, because somebody who watches some kind of true crime show is dying to talk to everybody about you it. Watch and it everybody's going to be there. You see it, you turn it off, and uh -huh. then sometimes you don't have someone to discuss it yeah. with. So now you'll have, you know, yeah. 20, 30 people to Unique discuss Unique socializing with. there. I like that. Oh, yeah. And then uh, what do you find at a winter farmer's market? I know they want to make sure you have produce and that yep. you stay toasty at Fire Forge. Of course, yeah. yeah. This is a new new spot for them, too. They used to be at Brewery 5 uh, uh, before, unfortunately, they closed. So this is uh, the, the Toasty Farmer's Market that has found a new home uh, at Fire Forge Crafted Beer. So you'll truck to downtown Greenville and uh, head to the brewery and they're going to have, as you can see there, some, some coffee from Coffee Coffee. And uh, you'll have uh, tons of local vendors from the produce like you were talking about, but also handmade items to start for that holiday shopping as well. But uh, right. afterwards, you know, now that we're sad that uh, we don't have the uh, Saturday market anymore, you can just come to Fire Forge uh, each Saturday. It's going to be going on from 11 to 2, mm -hmm. um, all November, January, all the way through through March. So this is a great, great excuse to come out every Saturday and just shop local. And a lot of toasty, too. You know, you got your handmade things to keep your hands warm. You exactly. got your coffee. You yeah, got there your might brew. be some You're mittens that you can buy, okay, too, good. as well. They'll be handmade and yeah. the perfect coaster for uh, koozie for your, your beer. It's going to be great. Stay toasty. Enjoy that. Those are just yes. a few of the events that we're talking about. Um, you've got a lot more on Greenville 360, your app and website. Anything uh, coming up that you're excited about? Uh, just to kind of get the holiday season going, mm -hmm. get the holiday shopping done that we were just discussing. And, uh, you know, there's a lot of events out there. Uh, so we'd love to hear from the people of Greenville. So if there's anywhere you want us to go, things you want us to talk about on this show, just uh, message us or email us, and we'd love to hear from you and, and chat about it. All right, good to be in the know. Um, David Cabron from Greenville 360. We yes, appreciate you. Thank, thank you. Thank you, as always. Bill can find you and Greenville 360 online and on social media in all of these ways on screen now.